decades old headstones found in pieces and underwater at a West Knox County Cemetery. A woman sent us these photos on Facebook. She's now on a quest to find the owner of that cemetery. The headstones are near Urinale Cemetery. It's on Willow Point Way off Hardin Valley Road in Carnes. In this 10 Listens report, Gabrielle Hayes shows us the crumbling headstones and why finding the owner is proving to be difficult. Gabrielle? Robin Vanjie Cowan spends a lot of time visiting cemeteries and digging up information, but it's what she found at one cemetery that caught her attention and her heart. This one just got me baffled. It's the kind of thing you don't expect to see at a cemetery. Do you see any more from that angle? Broken and misplaced headstones dating back to World War II, found along rushing brown water, waiting for someone to pick them up. We were doing pictures for Find a Grave, and one of my friends told me about this cemetery. Findagrave.com volunteer Vanjie Cowan and her daughters stumbled across the broken headstones near the Yarnell Cemetery back in 2014. Since then, she's worked to find the owner. We asked cemeteries how they had permission to bury people here because some are recently buried and they could not give me contact names. She told me that she couldn't find anybody listed. We spoke to the Knox County Property Assessor's Office to see if there was any record of who owns the property. The records list Paramount Development as the last recorded owner in 2005, but a further look into the company didn't provide answers. I wish that we could get them all out and place them where they need to be, or at least place them up here in a memorial site. Many of the headstones are listed as veterans with American flags next to their names, only fueling Cowan's desire to find an owner and get permission to lend a helping hand. Some of them down there say World War II on them. Some of them are their wives and they need to be up here where they can be honored. Cowan says she will continue digging and asking questions in hopes that someone will come forward and answer her call. Robin? And we hope they do. Gabrielle, thank you.